I are clever. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Settlers Saturday, episode 43, yes? Is that right? Yeah, 43, that's pretty cool. Um, how are we doing here? Okay, big army, big army. I hope you all had a, a very nice Christmas, or just a, a nice week, depending on how you celebrate things. Uh, yeah, hope that all went well for you. It's strange talking about that now, because I'm, uh, I'm actually recording this on a Monday. The Monday before the Settlers Saturday, so um, it hasn't been Christmas yet for me, but you know, I think I'm going to have a quite a busy week, so I thought I'd set up this episode now, sort all this out, get it out of the way before I have to rush things, because I hate rushing episodes, That's it gets really, I don't know, I like to be nice and relaxed when I'm doing an episode, do you know what I mean, so doing that now, oops. There we go. Yeah, so I hope that all went well for you and you had a very nice time, etc, etc. Things like that. Let's have a look how we're looking here. What is going on here? We've got a conga line. I think we're getting a bit of stone. Must be heading for the stone. What are we building? We did put a few projects on actually, didn't we? Last episode. I can't remember. It was obviously uh, a few days ago. Uh, oh, what's this? Oh yeah, we, we were going for this marketplace over here, that was the idea. If you missed last week's episode, um, I was saying someone suggested we make a donkey farm, which we've got, and then a marketplace, and then send a few things up here and have like a secondary base instead. Let's have a look on the map here. Yeah, you see this big thing going back and forth, the base is all the way up here. A little bit awkward. So, uh, seeing as this is so far away, someone suggested we use donkeys, and I think that's a pretty good idea, so we're going for that. Um, what are we getting all this stone for? So we're getting three stone for this, a few stone for that. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, water works as well. Yeah, okay. Cool. Cool, very good to see, to see there. Our soldiers have moved here, which means they've probably chased, probably chased a thief. Then again, look at these soldiers. They're um, spear women, which is not the, they're like the slowest of the army. Let's see if there's any sword fighters. There we go. There's one at least. Let's get, um, you know, swords women down there instead. Because they can walk a little bit faster. Yeah, maybe an archer just to defend ourselves. Or two. Yeah, so we're pretty much set against thieves now. If any thieves do come in from this bottom base at least. I think from the top base we're not really very well defended. But never mind. What are you doing? <laughs> What's this lone pioneer doing? We're going to leave it to it, see what happens. Okay. So when that's built, we're going to send. What we're going to send over? We need um, a few tools at least, so we can build buildings there. So let's go to the toolsmith. We're going to need one hammer and one spade. Um, then we've got such a big base here that those hammers and spades are going to be used up straight away. So we'll go and do this old trick here, where we go to the settlers and drop the amount of builders and diggers we're recruiting there to zero so no one should pick up this hammer and spade we're doing um, let's get a couple of pickaxes as well mm, now we could be a little bit quicker and you know do an extra hammer and an extra spade one two three four five six mm, no I tell you what yeah we'll just leave it as one hammer and one spade we'll go with that okay we've got some random pioneers here let's convert them back I don't know why they're there, there. Oh, there's quite a few. Let's convert them all back. Yeah, okay. Okay, so yeah, I hope you had a good Christmas. Um, yeah, and everything like that. I hope you have a nice new year as well. Though, is there going to be an episode before the next new year? Uh, maybe can't think possibly around that time anyway so uh, I guess I'll wish you a good 
a happy new year around then, maybe next episode. Yeah. Um, pretty cool things. I hope you got everything you wanted. My <laughs> right. Um, so I'm I'm 24. If you didn't know, I'm I'm like a full not a full grown man. Well, I guess so. Yeah, full full man in the eyes of the law, at least you know, full grown man. And uh, my mum said to me that she was going to buy me a PS4. <laughs> I'm, I'm like a man, you know what I mean? I've got a job and everything. Um, yeah, and I got a bit excited about that, like a little girl at Christmas, you know what I mean? PS4, loving it, yeah. So uh, hopefully that would be cool. She said she was going to get uh, The Last of Us as well, which The Last of Us, I don't know, I've heard a lot about it and I've not had, I didn't have a PS3, so yeah. I heard a lot about it, and I've, I've like purposely tried to avoid spoilers from it. You know what I mean? Like not watched anything about it. So I'm, I'm excited about that. Like a little kid, I feel like a little kid, even though I'm 24 years old. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, enough of that. Let's get back to good old Settlers Saturday. Just about to build this marketplace. We've got quite a few donkeys already here. Now we can stop production here at this at this donkey farm. How many have we got here? Is that... Hmm. Let's have a quick look. And the people count seven. Yeah, that looks about right. I was just wondering if it, any had ran off. So we've got seven there. Let's keep going, actually. I mean, we could pause this, but we'll, we'll keep going. We've probably got all the buildings we need built. Oh. Apparently not. What happened with all that stone? All these people came up and grabbed a load of stone and I'm not quite sure where it went. What are we doing here? Okay, okay, got a little bit. I'm thinking we might get another green farm or two because I think these green farms are quite taxed here. Yeah, quite taxed. If you look, there's the donkey farm that needs it, the pig farm, the green mill. Yeah, is that it? I think so. So let's build, I don't know, a couple more at least. Let's find a nice area for it if we can. That seemed fairly flat. Anywhere else? Looking for somewhere fairly flat here. This looks okay as well. Something like that. Is that right? Yeah. Um, screw it, let's go for one more as well. Yeah, that'll do. So we're going to need three scythes for that, of course. Three. And I tell you what, let's... Oh, they've not... What are they doing? They all walked away from it. Let's put that on a high priority. It looks like it's, like, so close to completion there. But for some reason, they decided to stop. Very strange. How many grain farms was that? Yeah, it was three. It was three, okay. I was just thinking it was four for some reason. Okay. Oh, look at that. So we've got this weaponsmith up and running, and I think that weaponsmith may have stole the hammer that we just built. Yeah. It looks like um, that was, I guess, fairly good timing. Yeah, fairly good timing. They stole the hammer for that weaponsmith, but whatever. Not a big deal. So we've got another one of them on the go. Nice bit of production here, I think. Couple iron smelters. I said this last episode, if this was a... Um, what, if this was an online game, it would be owned by now. We're two, two and a half hours in. Yeah. We'd be getting dominated by now. I'm looking at this gold as well. I keep looking at it and thinking we should do something with it. I've got a feeling that's a thief there, actually. Send in the army. I'm not sure if it is or not. Maybe not. Let's have a look. Yeah. I keep looking at this gold and thinking we should do something with it. But then it's... I don't know. <laughs> we need all the stone we can get. We're actually actually running out of stone here. Look at this. There's barely anything left. And this stone cutter is kind of running out of space as well. Yeah, I can't really get any closer. Okay, we'll leave that. We'll leave that for now. So th these have got such a journey to go on up here. 
Is this built? Okay, okay, that's good. Now I've got to remember how to do this. I was saying before, how many, what level are we on now? Nine, I think. Is it level nine? I don't think I've built a donkey farm yet. Um, so we first we choose the end of the route, which I guess is going to be there. Okay, so that's just a big straight line, which you don't really want. We want to try and figure it out a little bit better than that. Let's go for the first waypoint of here. Yeah, that kind of works. That works. Okay. Second waypoint. What could the first waypoint be here? Would that work? Yeah, okay. Okay, that's cool. So they've got these waypoints. I think... Um, I always thought it was so you could avoid enemy bases or you could keep it as far away from an enemy as possible. Um, which is, I guess, what we're doing. But in this circumstance, we're going <laughs> to try and let it figure out all these little twists and turns that are really annoying and, and it can't really can't really figure them out so this is just a little helping hand I guess we've still got quite a bit to go let's try and get this second waypoint um, oh, this is going to be hard here and then the third hmm this is the complicated bit. The third, I guess, is here. It's just this little bit. It's going so well up until that point. Look at that. It's perfect, perfect, perfect. Not so perfect. Um, now, I don't know the best way. I'm not sure if the best way for the donkeys to go would be round here or round this top bit. See, there's two options. Um... I don't know. We'll have to leave it like that. We don't have any more waypoints to work with. So yeah, let's let's get into that. Let's build a stone cutter's hut here. Three wood and two stone. Easy enough. So let's go with uh, six wood and four stone, and we'll build two. How about that? Of course, we need that hammer and we need that spade. And let's put this on a high priority, which is nice. That's a nice little feature there. We can put it on a high priority. Pretty cool. Yeah, okay. Now I'm thinking maybe we could go for a small residence here. Huh. That's a thief there, definitely. That <laughs> that one's definitely a thief. Not really much we can do about it, but could we go for a small residence? Would we need one? Possibly not. Then again, we're going to have to build another marketplace on here, thinking about that. Yeah, we're going to need another marketplace. So yeah, let's go with a small residence. I'll tell you what, I'll put that on high priority. So what's that? Four wood, two stone. And then, uh, I can't see that building there. What, how much, what materials does a marketplace need? Three wood and one stone. So that's seven wood and three stone more. Okay. Okay, so that's everything we need, I think, if I've calculated it right. That's everything we need for two stonecutters huts, um, a small residence, and a marketplace. Hopefully that should be alright. Cool. Still producing troops like crazy. Maybe we could attack. What do you reckon, guys? I've not even thought about attacking. We've obviously been able to defend ourselves quite well here. Could we attack? I kind of want to be able to reveal the map first, you know. Um, it looks like we need another small temple as well to be able to handle all this. We do have quite a few projects on the go at the minute, actually. And they all need that bloody stone. Okay. Yeah, okay, so we'll think about a small temple. We'll bear it in mind, at least. This storage area is devoted solely to fish here. Which I don't want. Okay. So I've got this storage area. For some reason it was only fish, which we don't really need anymore. Um, so let's put it to use. Okay. 
hopefully I've just accepted the mead there so they should start storing the mead they've got one there already um, which will probably make use of it better yeah a bit better use of it is to store it a little bit and then later we can come back and think about a second small temple here can we promote by the way talking about temples that we can oh we can promote twice I accidentally promoted the bow women there even though we're going for spears <laughs> silly me they were 31% of the way to promote again yeah we should have gone for the spears there but naturally because I always I always 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 go for the bow women I promoted them first silly me never mind though can these I'm not sure how many resources these these donkeys can hold I assume it's two like one in each you see those little pouches on either side of them I assume it's one in each of that so two four six eight ten yeah okay so this is the easy bit that they've done they've managed to get through that I think what are they doing yeah okay that works <laughs> kinda yeah that works and we'll see they are kind of messing up a bit there which makes me worried because uh, yeah see how they're, they're walking in like really straight lines as well yeah if they're messing up here which is an easy bit it makes me worried for this bit here we'll have to wait we'll have to come back and check them out when they're walking around here yeah yeah let's send a little army in we're, we're producing weapons quite fast here with two weaponsmiths can the iron smelters keep up with it? I think they can. You know, I think they can. I think they're keeping up. We could possibly even think about another iron smelter because the weaponsmith. It's all going quite well. I think, yeah. Pretty fast troops here. Maybe we're going to have to think about a large residence before soon, which is a little bit annoying. Let's go in with this army, see what we can do. I think I just selected a hundred there, not this lady, not you. Send her off. A life of retirement. There's always got to be one that retires. There we go. Come down here. Some exotic islands down here for that lady. Let's see what we can do with this force here. There are quite a lot of archers here, but that is that should be okay. Let's get a few more. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Let's get some priests in at least. Oh, they've been totaled already. If we can attack this area and get a little bit of stone, that would be perfect. All I'd have to do is get a few pioneers to clear up this area. Go on. Oh, this is dangerous. Oh, of course they've got their priests as well. Oh no. Okay, okay, okay. They've got convert barbarians. That's one of the Roman tricks. Convert barbarians, which kind of sucks. It looks like we might be getting this bottom tower, possibly. Oh, there we go. Convert barbarians. We just lost a whole load of troops. Let's send a few more in. Possibly. And some priests. Oh man. Oh man. That's not looking good. Let's get <laughs> let's get out of there. Let's bail. Um can I freeze this enemy? Oh frozen. You got froze. <laughs> you got froze. <laughs> okay, that's not a real word. But froze them there, they should be standing still for a while. And now maybe the backup has arrived. Let's see. Freeze them again. Okay. Frozen again. That really helps actually. That's a really good spell. It looks like we can't do any more spells whatsoever though. Yeah. That's a huge chunk of my army as well. If we get attacked again now, not going to go well. Then again, we're producing, we're kind of replacing troops quite fast now with these two, uh, two weaponsmiths. 
Are we going to be able to do anything here? I can't cast any more spells. No point having the priest there. Let's see. We do want this large residence being built though, so I'll put that on high priority. Cool, cool. Let's can we take this tower? That would be nice to see. If we could take this, I'd be happy. Let's get out of the way of all the archers there. See what we can do. We've got to take one. We can't all be in vain. Let's t try and take one tower. I'd love to be able to reveal the map and, and see everything that's going on. Okay, okay, some reinforcements there. That's quite a sizable amount of reinforcements as well. Can we take the tower in time? Now this is a, quite a few uh, spearmen here, actually, or spear women at least, uh, which is an, mm, it's a soldier I don't really use that often. Yeah, okay, okay, we might have to bail again. <laughs> bail! Oh my god. Okay, maybe not. Fight to the death. Fight to the death. I don't think the bailing was working very well there. Uh, yeah, not good. Not very good there. Oops. <laughs> Completely wiped out. I thought we'd have a chance there. I guess they've had the same amount of time, probably a little bit longer to be making troops. Um, at least we know what we're up against. Though we could get attacked now at any moment. What's going on here? Yeah, we could get attacked again at any moment. And it looks like we are about to be attacked. <laughs> ha. Oops. Maybe that was a very grave mistake. Maybe probably shouldn't have done that. Never mind. We've got this large residence on the high priority. Should be churning out people as fast as possible. Um, yeah, let's get this barracks going. Look at this. They've got a few troops on the way. I'm glad we caught that though, it's good to see. Glad we saw that. This looks like the route they're coming back. I wonder if they took that route on the way there. At least they've managed to drop off all the materials. That's good to see. Nice nice little donkeys there. Sorted us out. Um What's she doing? What's she doing? We'll send this lady back. Come on. Okay, yeah. That's another problem. If we do get attacked, they can attack the donkeys. Now, they can't kill the donkeys, but if you see, they attack the donkeys and then they drop their items. So that looks like a quite a sizable force coming in, actually. I might quickly swap this over to bows. Just so we can defend ourselves again. Yeah. We can't even cast spells by the looks of it because we have no... Or barely any manner. Okay. Maybe that was a silly mistake. Who knows. Look at this grain farm. Completely. It's got all the materials it needs and it's not being built. What's going on there? Um, I would put it on a high priority. But we probably want to focus on this large residence first. Yeah. Actually screw it. We'll put this on a high priority. The large residence needs what 10 stone or something daft. Okay. Okay, okay. Quite a sizable force here on the way. These are all swordsmen as well, which means we've got to wait for the bowmen. And, um... Okay. I thought they were looping back around there. Yeah, we've got to wait for the bowmen and the spearmen to come as well. Okay, okay. Let's do this. Fight under the towers again. Let's get these priests out of the way. We don't want them to die. this might be it this might be our final moment I thought I'd be a bit entertaining get a bit of combat going oh wow 
what an army coming to <laughs> coming into our base now. Can't even super spam them with archers as well. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. Uh, we can't really see what's happening under the trees. Oops. What we are looking for, of course, is a lot more yellow yellow blobs than red blobs. That would be our ideal situation here. Uh, as if we can't cast any spell. Oh, we can. We can cast spells. We can banish... Oh, cursed arrows. Okay. Not yet, though. Okay, okay, let's see how this goes. Any archers coming in? Okay, we've got some archers coming in there. Some enemy archers, even. So I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll go up here and try and curse them. We've only got one shot with it, though. Let's see what we can do. Oh, these are archers as well. Go on. Now, I don't know what the range is on this spell, either. Okay, there we go. Oh, she died. She didn't cast it. Go on. It looks like nothing's happening. Whenever I cast it, I mean, there's the animation there, but there's no... Unless I'm... Hmm. I don't know. We'll leave it. We'll leave it. It looks like our army's been completely wiped out there, which absolutely sucks. However, they are all archers by the looks of things, and so there's not really anything they can do. Okay, let's send these six archers in to see what they can do. Yeah, archers, of course, can't take towers, so, yeah. <laughs> Maybe that was a bit silly, sending everything I had in. Never mind. Never mind. It looks like we've managed to fend them off a little bit here. Yeah. Let's try this one more time. It's casting, it's strange, it's casting the spell look, but... And you get the animation, but then nothing's happening. I don't know. We do have some troops here. We could send them in to try and defend ourselves a little bit. Probably not going to happen. Oh, there's backup. There's backup. That's not what we want to see. We don't want to see backup. Okay. Because if these can get like a couple of um, swordsmen in, we're going to be screwed. Yeah, we don't want that. Oh, there is a little fighting force here going off. I sent them in before against the thieves, if you can remember. Which I thought there was a thief there. Okay, they're bailing now. Okay. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Maybe that wasn't the best idea. We need to send a few more items on these uh, with this donkey now. I'm not sure how many got dropped. You see when they got attacked, there's obviously... I saw two... Yeah, two wood here. And a bit more wood, okay. As long as there's no stone being dropped. Okay. So we've got these grain farms up and running now, so soon enough they should be churning out a nice amount of grain for us. Looks like this one has already started churning out grain. Which is good to see which means that we should have a lot more for the donkey farms, a lot more for the pig farms and a lot more for the grain mill here which all seem to be lacking grain now I can cancel this donkey farm potentially uh, yeah I could do that, I could cancel the donkey farm now because how many donkeys do we have? we've got ten is that enough? is ten enough? yeah you know what I think it is I think it is. We only need a few materials here. We don't need loads. We do need to capture this area back. Look at this. What's this? There's a 
There's a archer there, okay. Go on, take him out. Yeah, we need to capture this area back. There's a few troops standing around there, which I don't like to see. And, yeah, that's the 30 minute mark, guys. <sighs> what an episode. What an episode. Decided to waste all of my troops. The Egyptian guy thought he'd take the most, well, make the most of it and capture my base, which I guess he nearly did. I, I saved a, f a few. Luckily, we've got these two weaponsmiths now up and running. Um, this one seems to be lacking in the coal department a little bit. But I think that's because, yeah, we, we're low on, on bread and things now. But I've stopped the donkey farm, so the chain reaction should be going. Look at all this wheat heading in the right direction. We've got four ladies here carrying that. So, yeah, I think we should be going okay. We've got a, a little bit of an army here ready to capture this back. What's going off here? Okay, they're going in the right direction, okay. Um, so, yeah. Hopefully uh, you've all had a good Christmas and I hope you all have a good new year and I'll see you next week for another episode of Settlers Saturday. <laughs>